Hi, in this session I'm going to cover how to use selective color in some images you have in PowerPoint. Now selective color, selective coloring, is a technique where most of the photo is turned into black and white or some kind of monochrome color, but there's some parts of the photo that are left in its original color or given a new color. So let's say for example we have this image here and we would just wanted to have the yellow color of that card, the penalty card, stick out and it will look like this. Or if we have an image like this where it's a nice little ladybug with a couple of colors and only have that ladybug and its color stick out with the rest of the image becoming uh, monochrome or in this instance or in the previous instance they are desaturated basically all the colors taken out. So I'll show you how to do that. So let's go ahead and just use the ladybug example. I'm gonna go ahead and make a couple copies of this image. I'm gonna right click here and duplicate the slide. I'm going to bring it down here and then duplicate it another, another time. So with this image first what I'm going to do is I'm going to take, I'm going to desaturate, I'm going to take the color out of most of the of most of this image. So once I click the image you can see that the handles are around the image and the context menu shows up under the picture tools and under format I'm going to go under color and go to color saturation and make it zero. Now once that's zero, I'm going to go into my next image here and I want to just take the image with the colors of the ladybug out. And you can do that by selecting the image under the format tab, go under remove background. So this is a pretty quick way to do it. It's going to remove any unwanted portions of the picture. So I'm going to go and click that and the image is going to turn magenta and that basically is the Im image portions that it's going to take out and I have these these handles where I can resize it a little bit so I just want to take it out where the ladybug shows up let's see and once that's selected everything else in this magenta color is going to be taken out so I'm going to go ahead and keep changes so it's going to take everything out and basically I'm just just going to copy this whole image here, right click copy and then just bring it to this image and overlay it on top and basically just paste the image. And now it just becomes a matter of just moving the image on top of this other image. I'm just going to use the arrow keys to move it up a little bit and it's going to take some fine movements and what you can do is hold your control button and the down arrow to just fine-tune the movement. And there we have it. We have our little caterpillar color uh, that is selectively colored. We have this image that is selectively colored and just the colors of the caterpillar show up amongst the other images. And if I put this into a slideshow view you can see how that looks. So I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.